I am Kenda Kennard, Regional Sales Manager with Four Winds Boats, and today we're going to take a walk through of the Horizon 210. This boat that we're looking at is the RS Edition. The RS Edition is distinctive in that its graphics and color scheme are one of a kind. This boat is shown in the black and red configuration. Additionally, there are three other colors. One of the great features is that you have a color-matched upholstery inside the boat. A feature of every Four Winds Horizon model is the stable V-hull that gives you lateral stability when you're at rest. It's gonna plane quicker so that you have less bow rise. It's gonna stay on plane at lower speeds, which is great for towing, tubes, or other water sports. The bow scuff plate, pull-up cleats, docking lights, the reed mat in the cockpit floor, the bimini top, swim platform mat, and the upgraded aluminum mag wheels on the trailer are all standard with the RS edition. They're all optional with a standard Four Winds Horizon 210. The standard windshield with the RS Edition is a low-profile tinted windshield. This one is shown with the option to go back to the standard windshield that would be on the horizon. The glass is curved in multiple dimensions, similar to the windshield in your vehicle, so that means that you're going to have less distortion through the windshield. The RS Edition features a standard bimini top. This is the optional bimini top that is included with the wakeboard tower. The ski toe is located at the top of the tower so that it comes out through the bimini top you can safely tow people even while the bimini top is deployed. You'll find stainless steel throughout the boat. Some examples include the grab handles, the cup holders, the latches, the hinges, and as shown here, the pull-up cleats, which are gonna pull out of the way so that you can't catch a bathing suit or a towel or a tow on them. A feature of the Horizon 210 is the ultra low profile swim platform. It's so low to the water that when someone actually stands on it, you're gonna notice that it will almost go underwater which makes it easier to climb aboard. Additionally, you have an extra long, wide-stepped ladder that's gonna go four steps into the water to make it very easy to pull yourself back up into the boat. When it comes to water sports, the 210 Horizon RS is fully featured with a ski tow eye in the back that's great for skiing or tubing. Additionally, this boat is shown with the optional wakeboard tower that's great for wakeboarding as you have a taller tow point. This wakeboard tower is new for 2020. Additionally, it has a gas assist, so it can easily be hinged down for lower storage heights. Across the stern of the boat, you have a full width sun pad. First of all, it's gonna hinge up and give you a walkthrough so that you're not walking on any vinyl as you enter the boat. When the walkthrough is in the headrest position, you have a full width lounge. When the transom seat is engaged, you have a backrest as you're sitting towards the transom of the boat. Under the port side cushion of the rear sun pad, you have dual level storage. You'll notice that first there's a, a top level that's gonna snap out of a mesh bag. It's great for towels or anything that you wanna stay dry and it will also drain down into the bilge. Once that's removed, you have a very deep storage. That is where also your stern light and table legs store. In the starboard walkthrough as you enter the boat, first of all, below your feet, you have another dual level storage. I found this is a great place to kick your flip-flops as you come aboard because there's no need for shoes in the boat. You also have line storage. Additionally, the transom trim switch is now standard. This allows you to adjust the trim of the boat from the rear as opposed to having to climb all the way in and control it on the throttle. You have L-shaped seating in the cockpit of the Horizon 210 RS. Additionally, on the starboard side, you have a seat that the backrest is going to move fore and aft. So when it's in the forward facing position, or as shown here, is in the stern facing position, which makes an excellent spotter seat. For under seat storage in the center, you have an insulated cooler. Now there is a drain in the bottom, so once that fills with water, it's just gonna drain into the bilge. And then on the port side, you have a fully removable cushion with a large storage area. Again, this is all fully finished fiberglass below in the storage compartments. On the port console, you have an easy storage. It's fully lined to protect all of your items. Both the port and starboard helms feature hand-stitched detailing. The driver's seat is a comfort ride bucket seat, which means that it has suspension, so it's gonna smooth out the ride. You also have a flip-up bolster standard, a vented backrest, and you have notched sides so that you can easily turn your body as you're driving the boat to create great conversation with your guests. Overall, the helm has great ergonomics and sight lines. The shifter is conveniently and comfortably positioned. Also, you have a tilt steering wheel so that you can adjust it for the height of the driver. Contemporary switches are located at the helm so that when they are flipped up and engaged, the light at the end lights up so that the driver can tell that it's engaged. 
These switches are surrounded by an aluminum billet panel. Multi-function gauges monitor all key functions of the boat. You also have a depth sounder with air and water temperature. Additionally, you have storage in the center area. Or if the boat is ordered with the optional GPS, that storage area is where the GPS is. One of the reasons why the storage compartment or GPS is in the middle of the gauges means that if a boat is at a dealership and you would like to add GPS to it, it can easily be done without replacing the entire dash panel. This boat is shown with the kicker stereo head. Additionally, you have four speakers, two in the cockpit and two in the bow. Now, if you upgrade to the optional premium sound system, you gain an additional set of speakers and everything is upgraded to JL Audio. Both the standard and premium sound systems are Bluetooth compatible. The in-floor storage locker features a hinged lid with gas assist, so that means you can open it with one hand and it's gonna stay open as you access your items. It's large enough for multiple water sports toys and it's fully finished gel coat, so it means it's not gonna scratch or damage any of your items. There's a rubber mat in there to provide additional protection. A water intrusion management system, or WIMS, is designed into every Four Winds model. What that means is that we're gonna try and steer the water away from your goods and your items in storage and put it in key areas that will drain into the bilge. As shown here is we have a gutter around the ski locker along with a drainage tube that's going to drain down into the bilge. Moving to the bow of the boat, one thing that you'll notice is the entire bow is wrapped in vinyl so that you feel very protected and secure um, along with lots of cushioning. Both the seat and the backrest are gonna hinge up into one large continuous finished storage compartment. So in the sidewall storage, you have, it's fully finished and you have assist handles. Additionally, you have great ergonomics to provide comfort for those riders in the front. Moving this bow cushion, you'll notice that you have a fully finished non-skid surface so that you can board the boat from the bow very easily along the non-skid. You have a hinged anchor locker. So there's storage for the anchor in there. Additionally, on the corner of each side, you have a line relief, again, to keep the dirty anchor line from being in the bow of the boat. It can be self-contained into that locker. The Horizon 210 RS includes a standard tandem axle trailer with upgraded aluminum mag wheels. And there is an optional upgrade to a galvanized trailer for those of you in saltwater environments. Additionally, the Winning Edge Warranty Protection System features lifetime warranty on the hull and deck of the structural components of the boat. You have five years protection against any osmosis or blistering, and you have three years for all components. Thank you for your time today and watching this walkthrough video of the Four Winds 210 Horizon RS. If you have any questions, please visit us at fourwinds.com or see your nearest Four Winds dealer.